Okay, in this video I'm going to demonstrate your path or pathfinder tools. Um, and these tools, I cannot begin to express how important they are for when you go forward with CNC production. So what they let you do is they let you merge or clip multiple vector objects together. Um, and when you're doing some type of CNC production, you need to simplify your designs. Uh, so that is incredibly important. So I'm going to reference these tools quite often in these videos here. So right now all I have is I have these two rectangles, both red with black uh, outlines or black borders. And I'm just going to place the two rectangles on top of each other. So they are still right now two rectangles. So the most basic path tool we could do, and I'm just going to select them both by highlighting a box around them both, is this first one. And the path tools are these green tools here. And that is your very simple group tool. So now they are still two separate shapes but they are grouped together so I can now select them in unison. On the far right of the green tools we have split. That now just ungroups them basically and it puts them uh, into a separate group. Now the more detailed tools are right here um, underneath these two squares. So the very first one is your union tool or your merge tool. That just went ahead and it put them together as two, uh, again they are grouped together but they are now one shape. So they are unified as one. So they are a solid shape here, um, no longer two separate entities. So I'm just going to undo that back up a few times. Okay, so now we have two individual rectangles again. Next is the difference. So what that does is it cuts out the overlapping piece. Then we have intersection. So now it keeps the overlapping piece. And then we have subtraction. So whichever uh, shape is on top uh, it went ahead and it cut that out of the bottom shape. So again, these tools are incredibly important if you want to merge your vector shapes, and they go for anything, not just rectangles, but whatever shape you're trying to combine. Um, and then the other tool that I'm going to demonstrate is your arrangement tool. So we have two rectangles. I'm just going to change the color of this real quick. So you can see that the yellow rectangle is on top of the red rectangle. And these arrange tools allow me to either bring forward or send backwards. So if I were to send the yellow rectangle backward, it's now behind the red one. If I were to send the red one uh, backward, it's now behind it, or again, I could send it forward, whatever it is. So that allows you to arrange these uh, shapes depending on which one's on top. 